Hey everyone, Shabby Gamer here, and we are back with some more of the Skyrim playthrough. Now, I think I'm more or less exactly where we were last time we died. Yeah, I can see a guy sat down there. I don't know if he's a bad guy. That's the problem. It's difficult to tell if people are bad guys or good guys, isn't it, really? But... Not sure how much longer I can hold out here. Should I shoot? I'm sure they're bad guys. But we're detected, apparently. Really got myself into it this time. I oh, know it's you, you Hello? tit. You. Thank oh, I thought I was about to get killed. Stranger. Then it wasn't. It was you. I'd almost given up hope of walking away from here. Yeah, I don't. I'm afraid I don't have anything. Name's Valder. Yeah, I, I don't have any healing potions or anything for you. Still, I may I'm afraid. Have lost a drop or two of blood. I, I nearly shot Please. him. I need help. I don't want to die in this damn log. I very close. I very nearly shot him then. Um. Because I thought he was the bad guys. I just remember that little walkway from the last episode where we got killed by two raiders. I just remembered that and I just went to go for him then. Luckily I didn't go for him. I don't, I don't know why. It might have been useful to kill him. I don't know. But There's a hunter over here and there who won't sell us anything decent. No, he's not here this time. Okay. Right, let's uh, whack a quick, quick save. Because I think we're pretty close now. up here was it we need to see them before they see us and get a good shot on them are we not close enough yet where are they I know they're around here somewhere nope that's a tree Maybe they were random spawns. Maybe they're not actually part of this area. Or they might be. Let's just keep sneaking just in case. We know we're close. It doesn't move too much slower in sneak, does it? So where are we going? Let's go up, don't we? Up the mountain. We continue to go up and then quick save, of course. Don't want to keep doing this over and over again. This looks like the area where they were. Don't see anyone. I don't see anyone. Doesn't mean they're not there though. Hmm. Were they random spawns? Or are they down his bit? It looks like there's gonna be people down there, don't there? So we've found the area we need to go to. I don't see anyone though. It was a bit odd that there were raiders and this is a witch's place, but there you go. They must have just been random spawns then because there's nothing else here now. Some dead stuff. So I don't know how difficult witches are to be killed. Lydia is this a bit of oh, those Lydia there. Just around the side of us, okay. We've got a better sword now, but. I feel like we want to try and be at some... Do we want to be at some distance from the witches, or is that playing into the witches' hands? I think either way, they can do pretty good magic on us from whatever distance, can't they? So I'm going to do some more sneak, because... Cheers, Bolo. Um... That did not do a lot of damage to it, especially with Sneak as well. Whoa, that does a lot of damage, doesn't it? So we do have an, an optional extra here to kill all of these witches, but at the moment, um, yeah. Come back. 
stand at the moment I'm wondering whether that's going to be easy or not. <laughs> Just one will do, but it's running now, it's running. Right, one witch is down. One witch is down now. Do we continue on? There's a lot though, isn't there? There's like five on the map. That might be a little bit out of our... Out of our, um... Skill level, I don't know. Got the witch's head, bone meal, some feathers and some orcish arrows. So we can stay and kill all the witches if we want to. I feel like we should do the optional extra. Let's try it. If it doesn't work, we've just quick saved it and we can leave and get out of here, can't we? But if it does work, then we might get some added bonuses. We might not, because the guy did say himself that... He said something about... Um, I need to get my... Um, I need to get a sword on it, don't I? Yeah, the guy did say himself, didn't he, that uh, that too much blood has been spilled when we were talking about killing the uh, the silver blade, or the silver hand, whatever they're called. He said too much blood has been spilt. Maybe we get away to the end of this, but there must be some sort of bonus at the end. Maybe another shout, maybe. I do have two souls to use, dragon souls. So I don't know where these witches are. They're quite a distance away, aren't they? Nice, doesn't even know where it came from. It's back away into the shadows. We can get another sneak shot. Shit spider. It's coming this way, isn't it? More sneak damage. Kill it! Boom. We didn't kill it. Lydia did though. Good. Good 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 Lydia. Whatever witch head. Well I will take it. That wasn't bad, we killed an extra one now. Say so there must be some sort of bonus for killing all these um all these witches. They wouldn't just say it as an optional extra for no reason. Generally optional extras give you added bonuses. Again, we'll quick save now because we've killed two. Get our bow back out because that sneak and sneak attack and the quick shot it seems to be quite a, an effective little way of doing it, doesn't it? Is there another one in this room? Maybe. It doesn't look it, does it? We need to keep continue around. Or is this the end of this little area? on some sort of altar. Potion of magic, stamina poison. It's in the barrel, some lavender, we'll take that. You forgetting that you can't take stuff in stacks. Is this not the right way to go then? Oh, there's a chest here. 56 gold, some elven boots. Not really worth much. Iron battle axe of shocks. Nice, I like that. I do like that. Uh, we're carrying too much now, though. That's a problem. Um, can I drop anything? Um, that's worth 125, though. But it weighs like 30. You're gonna have to store that in there, I'm afraid. Right, so it looks like we might have to go back the way we came. That looks like it's the only way in and out of this room. So it's a case of just going down these different little areas, I suppose, and just killing the one witch. And that. at least that's not too bad. Then, if it's just one witch, then we know we can probably get a good fight out on them. If it's more than one witch at a time, that's when we're probably going to struggle. So it looks like there's a different way down and every way down is going to have a different witch in my looks so I'm going to I'm going to guess that anyway. So this is the way we came in and there's the witch we killed. So there's going to be another witch down this way. 
Lydia, are you still with me? Lydia! Oh, crap. Lydia! Oh, there you are. Thank God for that. I don't want to lose you. Yes, it looks like it's a little, like, a spider sort of shaped cave. Not going after Lydia, just following us the whole time. Um, I can do a. Is there one of. Have we got rid of all the ones that look after us for fire? We have, haven't we? I got 45 health. It's going to give us extra health. Dead, right. It's another one down. Where'd the body go? It's over here. Got a, a graven claw. Ooh. Again, we'll whack a quick save. Let's go into a little area and see if there was anything up here worth stealing. 41 gold is always nice. What did I set the basket for? <laughs> I don't know. So just 41 gold in this one, so not nothing major. If you die, stood up. Okay. That's an interesting way to die. So two more witches to take down. And we're doing pretty well, actually. We're doing better than I expected we were going to. After killing that first one, I sort of panicked. But now, um... Now I think we're doing okay. So there's two more witches to kill. One down this way by the looks of it. And one down that way. We just came down that way, didn't we? There must be one in here. We need to get... Getting that um, that couple of sneak shots is just such a massive thing though, isn't it? We need to make sure we still get that sneak shot. See ya. Go on, go back around that way. Come on. Move, come on, move. I think she's coming this way. Yep, she's coming this way. Nope, she's gone. Okay. I need to get a shot in this time. I need to hit. I need to hit this time. Gone in. So as soon as Lydia gets the aggro, I'm fine. I can just pepper her with bows, or arrows even. Right, witch down, witch down. One more witch to kill. I don't know if these heads do anything for us. I know we collected one for the mission, but I don't know if collecting loads is going to help us out. But we might as well grab them, mightn't we? You not even got a chest or anything down here. Well, the other witches had chests. I'm not missing it, am I? No. No, you just didn't have anything. You're just a crap witch. Right, so one more witch to kill. And then we are good. Let's hit a quick save. 
I say, I hope we're going to get some sort of bonus for killing all these witches. And I don't want to lose my werewolf ability. I want to keep it. Okay, there's another way up there by the looks of it. Is that not the way we went? No, it isn't. We went straight past that one. Okay. There's another way over here. So, Lydia, are you with me? Lids. How do I keep losing you? For God's sake, there you are. You're stuck over there. Come on, look. Look, I'm here. Look, I'm here. Okay. You okay now? Over this bridge. Are we good? We good. Okay. Let's sneak down here. This is the last of the five witches to kill in this cave. to get the sneak shot because the sneak shot gives you such a good help good start in the fight doesn't it back away doesn't know where we are whoa spider spider's dead whoa witch Lydia. You distract her, I'll pepper her. Stick with our skills that we're good at. And this will be the final witch dead. Now she's healed herself. Healed herself again. Had a good chance to level up my... Um... There we go. Optional, wipe out the witches. We've done it now. if that was a good thing or not but we've done it orcish arrow has got some more stuff that we can use for doing other bits and bobs where's that spider i can't see it like i say because it's really bright here i'm playing the game in like broad daylight it's really bright i can't quite see anything i can't see the body of the spot is this here there it is yeah frostbite venom we'll take a bit of that right let's come around here to your area see if there was anything good up here there's an enchant by the looks of it there is. So that'll give us a little bit more weight wise now. I think if we um, disenchant some stuff like that, we'll disenchant um, this. It's worth a lot of money, but we can disenchant it. And this, again, it's worth a lot of money, but we we'll disenchant it. And I think we're going to disenchant this. I really want to keep these, but if we can learn the enchant, then we can start to put it on other bits. There we go. Enchanting increased to 26, which is good. There's a book here as well. Is that going to teach us anything? It does. It can teach us more enchanting. And ding, we leveled up as well. Nice. We've leveled up. Such a goat. Right, so we just um, we have just used up a lot of coins with a stuff like, but I don't. I've not done enchanting before, so I've got no idea if this is going to work or not. So if I do um, carry weight, I need a soul gem. I do have soul gems. Can you make soul gems? Ah, soul gem. Petty soul gem. I can make a petty soul gem using a soul gem. Hmm. Choose an item to destroy and learn its enchantment or combine an item enchantment and a soul gem to create magic. Okay. Like ruby necklace. Fortify carry weight. I need a soul gem. Okay. Well, I've got minor soul gems, but not good one. I need to figure out. I need to watch like a, a tutorial video maybe on enchanting, and we'll we'll rock into that in another episode maybe. So that is the end of that one. We've killed all the the witches, which is a good thing. I didn't think we were gonna kill them all. To tell the truth, when we first came in, I started to panic and thought we were gonna get absolutely destroyed, but we seem to be okay. Let's go back and hopefully killing all the witches is gonna be. A good thing rather than a bad thing because now I think about it the guy did say when we took the mission and we spoke about the amount of damage that I've been doing to um, to the silver blades he said uh, too much blood has been spilt um, to warrant revenge and now we've come in here we only had to kill one and we've killed all five so maybe that goes against what he was telling us and it might end up being a bad thing but hopefully not generally doing um generally having the, the, the doing the optional extra is generally a good thing normally so uh, hopefully it will be a good thing again.
So I'm looking for White Run. Where are you? There you are. Just go into Dragon's Reach and walk down to the Companions. It'd be good if you could fast travel directly into a certain place, like the Companions place. Because at the moment, I really want to get through all the Companions sort of um, sort of missions. I feel like that's going to be a good way forward for us at this point in time. You can do some damage to them. This is a long mission. There we go. Long mission, long loading screen. We do um, we look and find some more shouts or somebody. I don't know if there's something, something you can just go out and find in the world or whether it's just all down to missions, but at the moment we have... Um, oh, we can get some Talos. I don't know what the Talos would be. Um, the silver hand. They finally had the nerve to attack here. your bastard. We got most... What was I saying? I can't remember what I was saying now. We need to level up as well, don't we? Bust into our level 15. Where have you been? I hope it was important, because it means you weren't here to defend him. What happened? The Silver Hand. They finally found enough courage to attack your Vasker. You joking? They fought them off, but the old man, Godlack, he's dead. Ah, oh, no way. No, but they made off with all our fragments of Wuthrad. But you and I are going to reclaim them. Okay. We will bring the battle to their chief camp. There will be none left living to tell their stories. Only songs of your Vasker will be sung. I'm in. We will avenge Kodlak, and they will know terror before the end. I'll head back home if you need. Okay. So we start a new mission. Is this? Oh, this is a silver hand. Gold lock picks. Okay. There's Codlac, completely naked for some reason. So Vikas is now going to be my companion for this next mission. Do these improve? Like the things up on the walls and that? Can I steal this? No, I can't. Okay. Are these the fragments of Wolfrand? I think they are, aren't they? Because there used to be stuff in that. I wonder if when you complete that, you can actually start to wield whatever it is they're on about. Be pretty cool. So um, I think first of all, I wonder if I can just if I steal all this stuff and sell it to the vendor. I wonder if it will respawn. Possibilities. Good thing about the silver hands is they always have a lot of gold on them. So I think first things first, I am going to go to the vendor and um, flog some of my wares. Make them bleed. Make them bleed. Oh, I will. Especially as they've got a lot of gold on them. Don't leave any of them alive. You want to hear a little Nord wisdom? You don't really know a woman till you have a strong drink and a fist fight with her. Well, you're a very aggressive lady, aren't you? I'm the commander of the guard here in White. I work with my mother to sell fruits and vegetables. It's fun most days, the hard work. Okay. Ripe fruit and fresh vegetables for sale. Yep, whatever. That's great. I need to go and sell some stuff to this guy. I've got some dragon bones and some dragon scales. Do we need to keep dragon bones and dragon scales? That's a question. Let me just have a quick uh, Google on this because I've been selling them all, but I don't know if they're actually good for anything. They, they come in the mist. Sale, my friend. I'd even buy one of your relatives if you're looking to sell. <laughs> dragon scales. Boom. Take a look. Dragon scales in Skyrim. It's a crafting material. Oh crap, maybe I need to keep them then. I've been selling them all. Dragon bones. It's a crafting material. I need to keep these then, don't I really? They're used to craft a dragon plate armor. I've been selling them all. God, that's that's terrible. Um, I apologize. Have you still got them? No, you must have sold them on. Um, do you have any normal sold them? Just got petty ones. I want a normal one. Okay. Weapons, what can I sell you? I have an Elven War Axe. Would you like one of them? It does 24 damage. If it's single hand, I might want to keep that myself, actually. Because I do have this, which is 22 damage. Uh, you can have that. And that, and that. 
Uh, I'm going to keep the nettle bane because I'm going to probably um, put it up in the house, probably. That'd be nice. Um, ruby necklace you can have. And steel shim boots I need to put back on. Um, Coulter's mask you can have. It's not worth much, but I should have kept that. No, I? Oh, sure, I'm sure I'll get some more at some point. So all these potions... Ones that I'm probably not going to use. Sleeping tree sap. Ooh, that's nice. I probably will use that actually. Then skooma. Can have all the skooma. Um, can have a bit of that. I don't need that because I've got my special um, ability. Anything that's worth 22 now, you can have. Anything that's worth 6? Nope, okay. We'll stick as it is then. Come back. We will come back. Because I always have stuff that I need to get rid of. So I do need to keep dragon bones and dragon scales. Um Yeah, I need to I need to keep track of that because that looks like it could be a good set of armor. Dragon Oh, that does look like a pretty cool set of armor. Is it a good set of armor? It's not the best. But you can upgrade it, I suppose. Okay. You know what's wrong with Skyrim these days? Everyone's obsessed with death. Right, so now where are we going to kill the silver blade? We're going up here, up into the mountains. Okay, where have we been to? We've been here, we haven't been there before. Maybe if we get a... We'll, we'll, go, we'll go across the Dawnstar, we'll get one the... Um, we'll get the thing outside of Dawnstar. That's probably going to be the best bet, and then uh, we can walk down from Dawnstar to go to where they are. What I feel a bit, I feel a bit stronger with this guy. I don't know why. I think because he's more, he's more of a warrior, isn't he? Whereas Lydia is more of a hunter. She's got a bow and arrow and that. Whereas this guy's more of a warrior, so it means we can step back and take a few shots. We look like we are going more down the the archery tree at the moment, don't we? Really? I don't. I'm not meaning to. It just, um, it just seems a lot safe for me to stand back and just fire some shots. Until we get like a, a bit of a higher level ourselves. Talking of which, let's level up quickly. Now I'm tempted to continue down the Magicka line to um to get the Bound Bow, but I think we need to go health because we're dying a lot recently. And I think having the extra health is going to be a good one for us. Now, if we also go for... Where's heavy armor? One-handed, we're pretty close to leveling up, aren't we? Heavy armor, there we go. Improves your armor by 20%. Okay, that is good. We needed that. that is, that's better for us now. We should have a little bit more... A little bit more. should have a 20% more um, damage resistance now, which is pretty good. And we wanted to go to... I forgot where it is now. Dawnstar, wasn't it? Dawnstar. So we want to travel to Dawnstar. Hello, this sir. Stupid. Need a ride? Where do you want to go? Dawnstar. Climbing back and we'll be off. Right, so here we go. Almost getting downright hot now. On our way to Dawnstar. You know what? I think this is a pretty good time now to finish this episode off. So um, in the next episode, we'll go to Dawnstar and we'll walk down to the Silver Hand camp and we will hopefully take them all out. Um, as always, if you have enjoyed this episode, then please do let me know by hitting that like button. It does really help me out. And of course, if you are new around here and you would like to see some more, then please hit that subscribe button as well for a lot more of the Skyrim playthrough. I've been Shabby Gamer. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all next time.